Okay, hello. This is day 25 of hormone replacement therapy treatment, specifically the testosterone blocker spironolactone. And our report, our update is basically nothing new. It's just peeing and sweating, which is what's expected. We haven't had any um, noticeable side effects from it. So um, next week, we have an appointment to get our started on the estrogen, which is uh, the next big step. And we're excited about that. We're definitely excited about that. And we're sorry for the thing kind of altering colors here. We don't know why it's doing that. But um, anyway, so. Um, Oh, uh, we put on some makeup this morning and um, went out and we got, we're wearing a dress. We'll show you the dress. You got to see some of our boxer shorts there. Um, but anyway, we got the dress yesterday at Goodwill. And this is one of the things that um, I think we wanted to talk about. Okay, so brushing, brushing hair, right? Um, we, mm, we did not get the chance to brush our hair a lot as a kid. And it is something that since wise feels relaxing and calming to us. And, but when you have short, short hair and balding on top, you don't get that, uh, that haptic sensation. Now, some people would say, oh, well, you know, you're just a cross dresser, right? And no, um, because there's a difference in the way that this feels to us. Now, someone can be a cross dresser like, uh, Luna Jade said the other day, someone could be a cross-dresser and uh, a transgender person, and that's fine. But you don't have to be one to be the other. And really, they're not at all uh, related. And beyond which, it shouldn't be a big deal. But for us, growing up in the South, in Texas, in the 1970s and 80s, it was a very big deal. And unless you were in certain cultures like rock metal people or wrestling people or different things, you, you know, just kind of looked down on you to have long hair. And also, even if you had long hair, it had to look a certain way. And really, hair is hair. It doesn't have a gender. And that's sort of what we're getting at today. We think, think, uh, want to shout out to Marie Charrington for reminding us of that. We posted earlier about this meme and then, um, but to, to go back to the question that of the dressing, you know, cross dressing, which is a whole thing. We don't consider this cross-dressing um, we consider this dressing in a way that affirms our non-binary nature and our transgender nature and as the hormone therapy goes forward we will see some changes and we want to know how they feel and every day is going to be a different thing to adjust to which is you know life basically but um, for now, we're trying this out to see how it feels, how it makes us feel, and it makes us feel happy. And so, for instance, just this, this, this right here, being able to comb this, you know, with this one of these, and these are, you know, you have to have certain brushes to cut, and that's a whole other thing. There's like 50 million hair brushes. Well, as you just saw, I. <laughs> 
<laughs> Ooh, there's, <laughs> there's like 50 million hairbrushes anyway. Um, and we're just now figuring out, you know, what, what works. And this is a different, you know, look than we had with the, we really love the purple hair look, but this is fun. And it's especially fun um, when you're imagining your Stevie Nicks singing you know, or something. Anyway, and so, uh, yeah, that's the day 25 update. And uh, thanks for coming by and watching. Uh, thanks you to our new subscribers. Big shout out to Bryn Avery, uh, who has been an inspiration to us for so long. And um, check out her. She has a list of non-binary streamers, YouTube streamers and other people. From And we met, uh, we started watching Ashley Adamson from that list. And she's making it bigger. And we're, we're on it. So we're happy, <laughs> happy about that. Um, and so we'll leave you with that and to all of our other subscribers too, you know who you are. We thank you. Uh, and we hope that you will, uh, stay with us on the journey. If you want, if you don't want to, Hey, uh, that's your prerogative, your prerogative. So anyway, take care. Uh,